All right, I'm a real estate investor. And one of the problems that I have is that I go into houses and I need to be able to very quickly estimate how much the repairs are going to be. And there appeared to be no tools out there to be able to do this. So being a programmer as well, um, I've worked with a, another partner who's more on the rehab side. And so the two of us joint ventured together um, and created a product that allows someone to very, very quickly be able to estimate the repairs. So I'm gonna quickly walk through the repairs. Now, all the numbers in here are adjustable. So um, if you look at a price and it comes back, you know, and you don't agree with that price for your area, then you can change it, all right? So I'm gonna pick up a house. Obviously, I've done this before. So um, Steve Smith is the owner, all right? And it went out to Zillow. And of course, we know how reliable Zillow is, says he chung in cheek. Um, in this case, it's not too bad. It is a 3-2, uh, 1,200 square feet, and built in right, right around 1950. Um, it came back and said this is $47,000. Um, we estimate it closer to forty-five, dollars um, And so we're going to go out and get that data, and uh, we're going to save it. Now we get into the core of the program. All right, so we're going to walk around the first. Okay. Oh, this, this roof is awful. So I need to replace the roof. Well, that's $6,000 because it's a 4,200 square foot, or, or excuse me, a 1,200 square foot house. All right. Um, we're going to do the painting. Um, it needs four windows because I can walk around and see that. Um, it doesn't have a garage, so we don't have any issues. Um, maybe a little light landscaping. So throw a thousand bucks in for the for the landscaping. Notice what I'm doing is putting in yes, no's, and 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 counts. So we go now. We walk on the inside. Oh, the whole place needs painting. Um, needs flooring. All right. Kitchen's in good shape. Uh, we don't need appliances. The bathrooms. Oh, well, the, one of the half baths needs replacing. Um, and so we're up to $25,000 in repairs, all right? Go downstairs to the mechanicals. Um, furnace, oh, gee, it's brand new, cool. Um, but it needs, it needs a hot water heater, so I select a hot water heater. So we now are at 26,000, all right? Not gonna be able to very, offer very much because there's a lot of work to be done. All right, so notice it just generated the um, the offers for me. Generates three offers. All right, it's the normal one that most people use for calculating an offer is seventy percent of after repair value minus the repairs. Well, if we have twenty six thousand in repairs, that could be a problem. All right, so we break this out. We say, okay, well we're gonna have instead of saying essentially 30 percent profit we're going to say we're going to have 20 percent profit but we have some closing costs and some holding costs because we have to sell it again and we're going to throw in a miscellaneous fee so our cash offer is 2600 or 2400 hmm working really good or if they want and they're willing to hold financing for a little while then we can offer more. So now we can jump up to, to $9,000. And if, and, but we have to come to closing with, um, with 18, with 1900. Or if they're willing to hold financing and we don't have to have any money, then we can offer them $18,000. And, if you look at the math behind this, this actually makes sense even for an investor, all right? But it would be kind of nice to be able to show this information to the seller. Oh, how about if we generate this PDF? 
So we're going to show them the offer details, the repair estimates. We'll skip the seller net sheet. Uh, it's another video. Uh, we have lots of features that I'm not showing you, so that's one of them. Um, and we're going to generate the PDF. Ooh, we could print it if we wanted to, or we could email it. So now it's printed in a presentable form, the offers, and the um, and then the description of the repairs. How often you go into a house and the the seller and you say, oh, there's twenty five thousand dollars of repairs here, and the seller says, oh no no, there's only five thousand dollars of repairs. Well, how about a, the the roof is six thousand dollars? Well, yeah, okay. Oh, you need to paint it. Oh, that's another three thousand. Oh, yeah, I guess so. We need some windows. Oh, we need some landscaping, interior painting, tile and flooring, a half a bathroom, and a hot water heater. Oh yeah, I guess it does total twenty six. Well, I could probably get it done with my cousins for a lot less. Yeah, maybe not that much less, because these are investor prices. So, and then the agreement, the purchase agreement. So we can, we can be, here we are with all this documentation ready to go. And if we carried a physical printer, which they're pretty inexpensive, um, then we could actually print this house and hand this before we even left the house. How many times have you gone into a house and said, oh, well, let me take this back to the office and compute it. And you lost the deal because somebody else slid in there. Well, now you can be that person coming in saying, well, before I leave the house, here's a contract and here's the numbers. The contract is specifically targeted at the, um, the cash solution. So if you're going to, if you choose one of the seller finance options, then you can scratch it out on the um, contract and you're off and running. All these numbers are changeable. So the percentages, for example, um, We've got 20% profit. Well, if you're in a tight market, you may want to change that. Um, the cost of a hot water heater. Well, if you can find installed a hot water heater for less than 800, maybe you want to change it. Maybe you don't. But anyway, so this product is available. Obviously, it's a su subscription, and it's at go to. Uh, www.rehabestimatorpro.com and um, there's some information on the front page and then go to the sign up page and you can uh, sign up um, and then you can become that expert. Um, we've got, we're beginning to get lenders that are now requiring that list of repairs and the offers as um, part of the documentation for lending for the uh, like the hard money lenders and so this is becoming a product that uh, a lot of people are, are using and um, you want to catch in there too rehabestimatorpro.com